Right, we're here at the Wanderers Cricket Field and Namibia has just beaten Zambia by eight wickets at the Under-19 World Cup Cricket Qualifiers. With me, Namibian coach Johan Rudolf. Johan, how was the match? Uh, very happy with the, with the result. I uh, thought the bowlers bowled very well this morning. We restricted them to 158 all out. I think it was about 30 odd overs. And the boys paced their innings very well eventually to get to the, to the target of 159. I think in 32 overs. We have a very good start with Vian van Fieden and Justin Bard. I think we got 51 off the 7 or 8 overs, so we went really hard at the bowlers. It's good to have two wins under the belt. Um, what we basically did is we split the, the tournament up in two halves, first four matches, and then we have a break next Thursday, or this coming Thursday, and then still free to go till next Sunday. Right. Uh, tell us about the matches lying ahead. Who will your strongest opponents be, do you think? Uh, what we basically, we set ourselves goals and just play each match at a time. We know what's our strengths and what is our weaknesses. Obvious Kenya will have a strong team, Sierra Leone. Uh, that's why it's very difficult at this point of the summer, really, who's going to be the top teams in the tournament. And if the boys um, just play according to their strength, I believe we will do well at the end of the day. Right, and just tell us who actually goes through to the World Cup um, after these qualifiers. Is it just the winning team or who actually? Now, that would basically work is the top two teams uh, will represent Africa in the global qualifier next year. I don't know what's the venue yet, yet where they join up with the Asian and the American countries. Uh, your islands and your Canada, those teams. Um, it's basically just the two teams. So with the, it's eight teams in this division two qualifiers where the top two teams, there's not going to be semi-finals or finals, it's just the end of the day, the net run rate and eventually the, the points throughout the tournament. Right, and Johan, you're also the senior national coach. Um, you must be quite happy with the junior talent coming through. I'm very, very happy. Uh, we've got a really good high performance program, which I believe is coming into place now. If you just look at our regional visits now, uh, if you have a look at the coast, I'll just spend a week there with the Kuala Burgers and your the place in the, in the coastal area. So there's a lot of talent coming through. If you take Gerard Erasmus, we're we'll betting him at number three, he's actually still a standard seven boy who's going to represent on the 15th um, in December, the end of the year. Pradel Vessels is still on the 15th. There's a lot of youngsters coming through in the system. Vian is 16, 17, already played five, six first class games. So I believe we are on the right track.